Motorcycle safety. Riders who have been cooped up all winter are excited to be out on the road again, but that shouldn't stop them from using caution. Riding a motorcycle is adventurous and an exhilarating experience. However, the harsh reality is that motorcycle riding can be very dangerous if proper precautions are not taken. In 2016, the U.S. Department of Transportation estimated that motorcyclists were 20 times more likely to die in a traffic accident than people in a car. The Department of Transportation also reported that a total of 5,029 motorcyclists died in crashes in 2016, an increase of 5.1% from 2015. With statistics like these, it makes sense to take safety seriously while driving motorcycles. Take a safety course. A safety course will teach you the rules of the road for motorcycles. You will also learn the appropriate actions to take in unpredictable riding situations that can arise. Driving a motorcycle requires skill and good judgment and a safety course can help you practice these. Check the weather before heading out. Rain, ice, and snow can compromise your ride. Driving in these elements is hazardous for bikers because they have less traction than a car and visibility is lower. Choose a different day if inclement weather is in the forecast. Wear motorcycle gear. Motorcycle gear protects you from the elements, debris, and road rash. Appropriate gear includes the Department of Transportation approved helmet, goggles, leather jacket, leather pants or chaps, over the ankle boots, and non-slip gloves. Dress in layers to adjust to any changes in weather throughout the day. Inspect your motorcycle before each ride. It's a good idea to inspect your bike before you ride to ensure it is as safe as possible. Check your headlights, taillights, turn signals, brakes, fuel, oil, tire pressure, mirrors, handlebars, and horn. Obey traffic rules, use your signals, and drive the speed limit. This may sound remedial, but it's important to follow traffic rules, use signals, and drive the posted speed limit to avoid accidents. According to the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety, in 2009, 48% of motorcyclist deaths were caused by excessive speed. Be visible. You cannot assume you are visible to other drivers. According to the Hurt Report published by the U.S. Department of Transportation's National Highway Traffic and Safety Administration in 1981, 75% of accidents involving motorcycles are due to the fact that other drivers did not see the motorcycle. Be observant and watch for road hazards. Driving defensively enables you to anticipate traffic problems and road hazards. Sand, oil, and gravel can make you lose traction. Bumps and potholes are equally dangerous and should also be avoided and cross railroad tracks at the appropriate angle. Stay a safe distance. Tailgating is not safe. It is recommended to stay at least four seconds away from the vehicle in front of you. This will allow you to stop in an emergency situation. Also, it is good to have an escape route in mind, such as moving to the shoulder should you not be able to stop in time. Carry a first aid kit. Keeping a basic first aid kit with your motorcycle is a good idea in case of injury. It should include disinfecting wipes, bandages, hand sanitizer, gauze, adhesive tape, and band-aids. Take an advanced riding course. 
Practice can increase your skills by taking an advanced riding course. You will learn collision avoidance maneuvers, advanced turning, control tips, and braking techniques. Select the right bike. Before you start a ride, you need to find a bike that suits you. In fact, for new riders selecting their first bike, the task can be as difficult as deciding on your first tattoo. But you can also rent bikes when you travel or test ride bikes before you buy. Many riders decide on their next bike based on how the bike looks when in fact this should be the second or third item you consider. It's important that you look at overall power, wet weight, power to weight ratio, your judgment. Always wear a full face helmet. Wear a full face helmet with a face shield or eye protection, always. Let's say Jim rides and always wears a motorcycle helmet except when he just needs to go to the store really quick to get something. Really? Most accidents occur at slow speeds and even at slow speeds, not wearing a helmet increases your risk. The helmet may save you if you hit a patch of gravel or an oil slick and your head hits something. Stay sober. Pilots have a saying, eight hours from bottle to throttle. Well, it applies to motorcycle riders too. Safe riding takes all of your concentration. You use all four limbs, your eyes, ears, and nose. You are always aware. You will experience increased blood alcohol content, impaired judgment, and delayed response time. Just don't do it. Brake for motorcycles. Just because you're on a motorcycle doesn't make it any easier for you to see other motorcycles. Always double check when changing lanes or turning. You also need to practice braking in all sorts of conditions. Get some rest. Being on a motorcycle requires a significant amount of focus. After a long ride, you are mentally exhausted. So when you ride, make sure you're a safe motorcyclist and get a good night's sleep. Highway hypnosis applies to both drivers and riders. So even when you're well rested, you may get tired during a ride. Spread the love. There's no denying that motorcycles are often overlooked or regarded as the second-class citizens of the road. As a rider, you have the chance to help change that. When you're on the road, always drive as if you are an ambassador for motorcyclists everywhere.